Buonasera, welcome to Rome. We are just outside of the city, obviously on the coast. Um, we're here for Half Challenge Roma. Just getting in, just getting settled, getting a fuel for everything and shaking out the travel with a little bit of a run. I'm here with Ava Commander. She is my training partner in Girona. She's Polish, she's amazing, she's camera shy. To the moon, get there by tomorrow afternoon. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think I love you. I'm in, look inside, check out all the things I tried. Do you want to say hi? Yeah, say hi. <laughs> yeah, we got magic in our heads. We play in the stars when the sun comes up. Get into my bed. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think I love you. I don't want to speak too soon. Uh huh. about the race and it was actually a really interesting race for me. It was by far the worst result I've ever had on paper. So that was kind of, that's always hard to take, but it was also one of the better performances that I've put together if you look at the metrics in the data. I'm not the best swimmer out there, so in those conditions, 15 degree water and choppy, I was actually just really happy to be with a pack and stay with the pack the whole time. The run was the run. I struggled on the sandy part of the run and didn't really feel like I had that push, but I think that was more of a mental thing, just getting back into racing again. The most interesting part of the race was definitely the bike. I just changed my setup last week. I only actually rode it a few times before the race. Um, and I know you're not supposed to change anything just before a race, but my old setup really wasn't working. I've been really struggling with my setup for almost, geez, over a year now. And I've been to lots of different bike fitters, had lots of people's opinions, but finally we found out that my lumbar spine's actually fused. So not being able to bend there has made my setup a lot different than other people's. We've just put on a new air bar and I've increased my stack quite a bit just to help open up my hip angle. So from that change, I actually have seen an increase in power. The drawback to that was I'm definitely less arrow. So although I had more power, I'm not sure I had any speed gains. I think partially because I'm also not quite settled into the position yet. It has all left me with some mixed feelings about the race. I do feel satisfied with the effort and I'm happy about the changes that I've made. It's not so great to finish so far down in the field. It was a really strong field. Still sucks. Um, oh, Ava actually got sick during the race and couldn't finish. But she's feeling better now and she'll be racing in Gran Canera this weekend. Um, and we're both racing together again in a couple weeks, also in Italy, also a challenge race, so 
We'll catch up with you there. See what I use as my Garmin mount? A sock. <laughs> Getting the job done.